guys and thank you guys so much for watching this video where I test out the Desi and Katie Joseph Colors makeup collaboration um, and I went to the reveal party last night and I ended up posting a very quick makeup tutorial and and I got a, I got backlash for it okay so let me just put this into perspective um I went to the reveal party and they not once they didn't tell us to not post a video they didn't tell us to not reveal it online um i feel like the whole point of um inviting the subscribers was one because you know they want they, it was dedicated to us and two so we can show our friends be the first to get it review it yada 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 um i was never told not to review this i was never told not to post swatches i mean you guys as soon as um we went into the theater which was at 5 30 people were already posting swatches we were like like not 5 30 it was probably like 6 30 um people were able to buy the product swatch it buy it do whatever you know they want with it so there was already swatches tutorials well not tutorials maybe like videos instagram videos um with the product itself so people are telling me that um it's a bad taste that i'm already posting a video before them but um I was never told not to and um, if you you know don't appreciate this I love Desi and Kitty so much and if you don't appreciate this please don't watch it um, keep your negative comments to yourself um, I'm just here for them because I love makeup and because I love Desi and Kitty and this collaboration was so like mind-blowing it was beautiful everything the attention to detail was absolutely beautiful and if you don't appreciate it for what it's worth and if you don't care for what I have to say then don't watch it um but let's go ahead and get on with this video okay guys so I'm gonna go ahead and use the Desi and Katie dose of colors makeup collaboration that they came out with um and that I got a chance to get my hands on due to uh the reveal party so um, I already have a full set, like a full face on, eyebrows did, my lids are primed, I already have eyeshadow as you can see on here, and um, I just, I just want to focus this video mainly around the makeup, so I'm not going to focus on anything else, um, I'm just going to, I will let you guys know that I did use the um, Morphe 350 palette on my eyes, um, and I'm trying to do more like a smokier eye, not so much, but it's going to be a little bit more dramatic. And this one's going to be more like casual. Um, or, you know, you can use it however you prefer. Uh, so I am going to go ahead and use the Girls palette, which is this one. It's called the Girls. Um, and so we're going to start off with Suze, Noli, Harpoon, and Turbo Sand, which are all their... Um, their dog's names, which is super cute. And this palette runs for $28. So let's just go ahead and get straight into it. Um, I'm gonna go in with a brush that is a little bit more dense. And I'm gonna start off, I'm gonna be using mainly these two, but I'll add the other ones here and there. So, this one has little specks of silver and blue and purple and it kind of looks a little bit brown too and it's like a press glitter I believe and it just looks so nice on um I'm doing this with just the eyeshadow primer but later I'm going to show you guys swatches of it on my hand with concealer and then also with just primer and just by itself too just so you guys can get the full the full effect of these um, reviews of these I mean the full the full insider scoop on these eyeshadows um, this makeup collaboration does drop August 14th so make sure that you get your hands on it it's so beautiful so beautiful so in at their party yesterday they did reveal that they wanted to do something a little bit different um you know everybody has their go-to matte eyeshadow palette and they wanted to do something with different colors of uh glitters that looks so pretty and um 
so this is why they chose to go just like all glitter eyeshadows which I think is super cool super fun um, I'm also gonna go ahead and bring that same um, color turbo sand under my eyelid I mean under my eyes because since it's dark it can act as my eyeliner kind of with all glitters this has you know fallout so be careful and make sure to set your under eye such a beautiful color and you noticed how I didn't go so heavy on the other eyeshadow because I wanted this to pop So next, I'm going to go in with the, this one, it's called Suze, and that one's going to be in my um, inner corner. Yes. Yes. So pretty. Um, I'm going to like add the eyeliner and the lashes on later, but I just want to show you guys the eyeshadows first. All right, and on the other side, I'm going to go in with Harpoon, which is a beautiful green, like a dark olive green pigment. So beautiful. Just those couple swatches gave off so much product. You are probably going to need a like concealer or anything you use to set glitters because it needs to stick onto something and I find that the that it's not sticking to it is sticking to my skin but there's a lot of fallout so in order to avoid that go ahead and like conceal it prime it however you use to stick on your glitters Whew. yes look how beautiful that is I don't even want to I hope this doesn't become a mess. I'm also going to bring that same shadow under my eyelids just to give it an extra pop. Fix that really quick. And I do find that um, since they're pressed glitter have to really swatch it. You have to get a good little rest on there. Okay, and this is also more of like a casual. I was trying to go kind of smoky, but I kind of like it like this instead. And then we're gonna um, go in with Seuss for the inner highlight. We're gonna pop it on there. First of all, the packaging is everything. The attention to detail is super beautiful. And I'm going to go ahead and do my eyeliner and my lashes later. And now I want to show you the Fuego highlighter. Super beautiful, versatile, subtle. I thought it was subtle at first, but boy, does this give you a pop. So, a little goes a long way. Let's see one more time. Yes. Do you guys see that? 
beautiful. And this highlighter palette is $28 as well. I like to use this brush for all my highlights. I don't normally do this, but for the sake of this video and trying to be extra, that is what I'm going for. I totally saw this when we did the meet and greet at the party on on um, Desi's shoulders. Like they just popped, and I knew she was wearing fuego. She had to be because it was just this beautiful shade, and it was just so blinding. Wow. Okay, so I went ahead and did a wing eyeliner on this eye and then just popped on some lashes on this eye because I wanted to give some variation to this look and I actually just finished watching um Katie's snapchats and she said that it activates it with water the eyeshadows are activated with water like it gives just a better payoff so that's what I'm gonna do I have my water and I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit more to the lid just she said to just add some on your fingers so here we go. A little bit more, a little bit more. Okay. Ooh, yeah. I'm about to swatch this right now, too, so you guys can see. Ooh, yes. Okay, okay, I can see that. Okay, let me go ahead and swatch Harpoon for you. Beautiful. Okay, now I'm going to swatch... Turbo Sun. Oh, a little bit too much water in that one. Beautiful. Actually, let me pop this on my lid first. And now we're going to do it. Yes. Now we're going to do Seuss. And this I'm going to go ahead and add on my inner corners of my eyes. Actually, I already did. Wow, such a beautiful shade. Now we're going to go in with Noli. Love, 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 love. Look at so They're so beautiful because, like they said, they are different. They have different kinds different colors in them and they just show up very well on the skin so now that I did these with um this with water I kind of don't know if I need the concealer or the, the eyeshadow primer but I just want to show you guys a couple of those swatches with the concealer um I just want to see how it works so that's the just grab any concealer and grab any primer and I'm just interested to see how those work out together I'm gonna go into what is this one harpoon yes harpoon and it's already wet like the since I had already put my I don't like that okay I don't like that canceled those are canceled no Katie's right you just use them with water and they're good to go um, now we're gonna go ahead and try on the lipstick so we have more creamer please and we have hot fire now I'm gonna go ahead and try um, more creamer please because it's easier to take off it's just a, a lipstick and the hot fire that lasts a long time this one is in a more creamer please I don't have anything on my lid on my lips other than chopstick. If I'm not mistaken, Desi was wearing this product yesterday and it looked so good on her. So this is more creamer, please. NC35. <laughs> 
front okay now I'm going to take that one off and I'm going to keep on hot fire because boy does that lipstick is so good that it stains I had to use oil to take it off last night a quick swatch on my arm for you guys just so you guys can see Fire has more of like an orange undertone, but the camera picks it up as red. Lining that up would be a better idea, but I'm not going to do that today. Very pigmented, flashy, beautiful liquid lipstick. And I chose this one over the other one, which I think was called Mirame. And it was more like a darker plum. And um, I chose this one because I don't have orange in my makeup collection. So I thought this one would be a perfect shade for me and for any look. And if you guys watch my other video, you will see that I showed you guys the packages that they came in and also um, like my first impressions after the party and also the packages that these came in and a couple of like the inside scoop of the party last night and the goodie bag that we received was such a blessing. It was everything was so beautiful. Like I like like I said in my other video, it felt very heartfelt like. I the just the, the experience of one meeting them being the first to see touch and um the, and like just see the the actual makeup for what it's worth was just like <gasps> the icing on the cake um this whole experience was like great and then the fact that they gave a goodie bag with amazing products which if you want to find out what it was go to my other video um, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. And like I said, these will be launching August 14th, so make sure to grab yours. Thank you.